Ladies and gentlemen, we are back in another video brought to you by Rib. First things, I apologise about the microphone. I am at work on my laptop and as you know, it's a bit of a potato compared to my other microphone when I do a, a decent video. Uh, so, this video is going to show you how to set up 5 Reborn. It's an updated video. Things have changed only slightly, but it's a different method. So, instead of people getting confused, uh, we'll just do it again. First things first, create a new folder on your desktop. Um, and call it whatever you want then go to the 5 Reborn website which is the link is in the description and download the client if you run in a server download the server but that's for another video download the client it's very quick click sure I agree and there we go put that client into that folder so let's go to our download folder uh, come on come on come on download 5 Reborn and simply just copy and paste or just drag that into that folder open it up and run it you will get a message about Windows 10. Don't worry about it if you're on Windows 7, etc. It doesn't make a difference. So what this will do, this will do a big update. We'll then get a message about a cache and we go update cache. We just click yes and that will carry on the install. When it's all installed, uh, nothing will be instructed in this folder. It, it's, it's, it will just let you the message know that it's been installed. And to run the 5 Reborn, all we do is double click. We'll come back into this folder and run this executable. So it's pretty damn simple, and this is how it's done. I'll let it do its thing in the background, and we'll come back. Okay guys, so now what we need to do is we need to select our Grand Theft Auto folder. Mine's already been selected, but it's in my D drive. Steam, Steam apps, common, Grand Theft Auto, and just select the folder and click OK. There's the message about Windows 10. Don't worry, just click OK. Okay guys, here's the message about the update in the cache. We just click yes, it'll carry on doing the installation and then we're nearly done. Okay guys, it's all installed. I've just got this little message here on about the Windows firewall, so allow access obviously. And we want, when we want to open the 5 Reborn and start playing some GTA 5 RP, all we do is go back to the folder where we installed 5 Reborn and double click this executable and that will open up our server list. So that is what we will do. However, I've got a million messages down below, ignore them. And once you've opened up the 5 Reborn file, it will look like this. And you just click multiplayer and this will generate all, all our lists. As you can see, these are all the servers. The main ones to play at the minute are State of Emergency and Revolution Life. So they're the good RP servers. Hope it helps guys, the phone is going. See us all again. Peace out, amigos.